I am running to be the MLA for Medicine Hat because I believe in smaller government and more efficient government and local decision making. I also believe that Medicine Hat has fantastic opportunities and I would love to be the MLA for Medicine Hat to advocate for those needs. Alberta does have a revenue and spending problem. Unfortunately, over the years, Alberta has over relied on oil and natural gas royalties, and this has caused troubles for governments in budgeting for supplying services to healthcare, to education, to seniors, to infrastructure. Until we get off this over reliance of oil and gas, natural resource, uh, non renewable revenues, we will continue down this path. Our party is the only party that is presenting an option for us as Albertans to get off this boom and bust cycle. In five years, our plan is to reduce our reliance on oil and gas royalties by 50%. This will be used to pay off the debt. It will go into the sustainability fund and it will go into the heritage trust fund. Until we actually get off this reliance of oil and gas royalties, this will be a burden that Albertans will have to deal with over and over again in the budgeting cycle. And we don't think that Budgets need to be dictated by a world traded commodity that somebody else on the other side of the world dictates a price for. One of the things I don't do is tie myself to timelines. The, th the thing that I really enjoy is looking at issues that we have in Medicine Hat and trying to achieve success, whether it's uh, the flood mitigation that uh, we're dealing with now in the city, whether it's the final phase of ending homelessness, whether it's uh, working with decentralizing healthcare, it's all about the issues and how you find a successful solution. So I don't like the timelines. What I look forward to is actually achieving the success at the end of the day. Everyday Albertans inspire me. I've been very fortunate over the last three years to be the MLA for Medicine Hat. In meeting with individuals, everybody seems to be challenged with certain issues in, at different points in their life and the way that they deal with these challenges is so inspiring to me. They're the ones that actually make me want to, to earn your trust and to earn your vote on May the 5th so that I can go and advocate in Edmonton for the needs of all Albertans and specifically all Medicine Hat people.